Tama is taking on billionaire businessman Johan Rupert. He says Rupert's call for President Jacob Zuma to resign is an attempted coup. Mutama's movement, Black First, Land First, BLF, has opened a corruption case against Rupert and eight multinationals for interfering with the president's duties in the appointment of finance ministers. Following his dramatic exit from the EFF last year, Andile Mkritama founded the Black First Land First, which he says aims to put land and the economy back in the hands of black South Africans. BLF is taking billionaire Johan Rupert and eight other bankers to court for contravening the Corruption Act of 2004. He broke the law and acted in corrupt fashion when he summoned and went into a meeting with the ANC leader, specifically Sir Ramaphosa and Trevor Manuel and instructed them to ensure that the firing of Van Royen as the Minister of Finance. We know that Rupert's interest, we know that Rupert has interest in the economy. So he wanted a minister who, who could take care of his interests. BLF members have embarked on a campaign that includes condemning the so-called Gupta whistleblowers, including former ANC MP Vicky Mento and Deputy Finance Minister Mkebisi Jonas. Both Rupert and Deputy President Cyril Ramaphosa have since denied the meeting happened. The only time that President Ramaphosa engaged himself with the matter of the finance ministry was during the meeting of the top six ANC officials with President Jacob Zuma on the Sunday leading to the appointment of Pravin Gordon as the finance minister. The suggestion, therefore, that Deputy President Cyril Ramaphosa met with Johan Rupert, Trevor Manuel and Maria Ramos to reverse decisions of the president on the finance ministry is thus wholly incorrect, mischievous and misleading. BLF has welcomed President Zuma's apology to South Africans following the Nkanda Constitutional Court ruling. Ntakwa Nangatani, SABC News, Johannesburg.